Well, the small community of Elkton in Cecil County is looking for answers tonight after police found the body of a three-year-old boy. Around three o'clock this afternoon, Elkton police announced that they found three-year-old Michael Richardson. It was in a little Elk Creek near the Elk Landing community. WMER 2 News' Janae Wright was uh, in Elkton earlier today, and she joins us with more on this sad story. After speaking with a few people in the neighborhood, including one of Michael's grandmothers, it's clear that many people are still confused about what happened to the three year old boy. And although his body was found, they have more questions. Elkton police completed the search for three year old Michael Richardson just over 24 hours after his disappearance. About just before three o'clock this afternoon, uh, sadly, we did find Michael in the body of water that runs close to where he was staying at his um, family members home. I spoke to some of Michael's family members. They tell me police found him in this body of water, but the family members also tell me that they suspect foul play. All I know is that my daughter contacted me and said that he was missing. Uh, when I got over here, nobody had any answers for us. We did a door to door search today looking for video, talking with residents to try to get any kind of information that we possibly could get. Michael's grandmother tells us while she's not sure what happened, she says she doesn't think he wandered into the water on his own. I need justice for my grandson. I don't think that he was just missing. I think that something else happened. He's three years old. He was autistic and now he is deceased on Mother's Day. I'm crushed. I asked police how they felt about finding Michael so quickly. A double edged sword, really. You know, that's not the outcome we were hoping for. Um, even though we had information that kind of pointed in that direction in the beginning. So we, you know, unfortunately kind of suspected that this was going to be the outcome. He just was a loving little boy. Like he didn't deserve this at all. And Elkton police say they are not ruling out foul play until the autopsy report is released and they finish the investigation.